Hi everyone and welcome to this video. In this video I will be talking about Baltimore Orioles. Male Baltimore Orioles have black feathers with a white band. They have a black head and an orange body. Females have black wings with a white band and a yellow body. Males take one year to develop their orange plumage. Their first year, they kind of look like the females. You can find Baltimore Orioles in the United States during their breeding season. They spend their winter in Mexico and certain parts of the year in Canada. You can find them in high, leafy, deciduous trees, but not in forests. Baltimore Orioles like forest edges. Baltimore Orioles eat a large variety of insects as well as their preferred diet of fruit and nectar. They will eat oranges and jellies. They have been interpreted as a pest to fruit farmers because they eat many crops. They will eat dark ripe fruits like the brightest oranges, darkest cherries, and the deepest colored purple grapes. Although they do ignore green grapes and yellow cherries even when ripe. The reason they eat these fruits with so much sugar is to store up fat for their spring and fall migration. The female chooses a nest site. They make their amazing nests out of hundreds of thin fibers. Their breeding season goes April through June. Only the female weaves, but both genders collect materials. Their favorite thing to line the nest with is fluff from cottonwood trees. The first step is to weave the frame out of grasses onto a branch. Then the female will line the inner bowl with down feathers and moss. Nest construction takes up to 14 days. The opening is small to keep cowbirds out. They have one brood per year which consists of three to seven eggs. According to the North American Breeding Bird Survey, the Baltimore Oriole population has been declining. Each year, 3% of their population is gone. Partners in Flight estimates 12 million, 82% spending part of the year in the USA, 18% breeding in Canada, and 24% wintering in Mexico. The main cause of their decline is due to insecticides being sprayed on trees and fruit crops. If you would like to attract Baltimore Orioles to your yard, put out halves of oranges, grape jam, crab apples, and trumpet vines. Here are some extra fun facts. 1. They have been the state bird of Maryland since 1947 and have special protections before the Migratory Bird Treaty Act was passed. 2. The name Oriole comes from the Latin word Orleos, meaning golden. 3. Baltimore Orioles are part of the Blackbird family. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.